won it with four faults last year, actually jumped her clear two years ago, but incurred one time fault. And of course, uh, that put him out of winning it. But can he get a second derby? Well, from here on in, this is where it's all going to happen, I would think, because it's been a good derby so far. Well, you never get a bad one, do you? It's always a wonderful spectacle. Uh, we've got two on four faults. It's been one on four faults before, but we've got an outstanding chunk now of six riders, any one of which could win it. And most of which could be very, very capable of jumping a clear round. Let's just enjoy it. Unobtrusive style of them, uh, stylish. Let's horses think what they're doing. But even so, runs him at that hedge. And only just got away with it. in and has the out part down. He joins the four falters. Fluffing his change of legs there, the horse just hanging towards the gate. Good water jumper, didn't matter as it happened. He's going to join them. Oh, how often do you see that happen? Not quite according to plan, Mike. No, the dream uh, hasn't come off for Ben there this year, no, and probably the gate was a surprise. But this is where the first mistake came. He jumped in impeccably at the middle bit and then just like several horses before him just laid a little bit of a toe on the on the out part but that gate has hardly been knocked down for years and years and years i don't think i ever remember anybody having that down well ben i know you're an absolute perfectionist so you'll be disappointed with that yeah i mean maybe he's not in his best form today um a bit unlucky out there the other bike just pushed him a bit out of the game maybe i should have waited but that horse is at the end of the day. Do you think the heat has anything to do with it? Yeah, definitely. I mean, he's felt a bit quiet today and things, but same for all the horses. Okay, well, I'm sorry you couldn't do it. 